Why does replacing a timing belt cost over $1,000 while another belt on the same car can be done for about $200? Once you see how a timing belt is installed, the reason becomes clear. First, a tensioner pulley is mounted on the engine block and tightened by hand. After that, two large gear wheels are installed on the engine. Do you know which internal engine parts these two gears are connected to? Next, a bolt is installed in the first gear, then another bolt is installed in the second one. A scanner reads the QR code on each gear and records it in the system. An electronic wrench then tightens both bolts to lock the gears in place. Now the timing belt is fitted onto the gears. A special tool holds the tensioner steady, and the electronic wrench tightens it to the required setting. The QR code on the timing belt is scanned, the engine cover over the belt area is installed, and a pneumatic wrench is used for initial tightening. Then a lower cover is installed and pre-tightened with an electric torque wrench. The engine is sent into a robotic station, where robots handle the final tightening. At this point, you can see how deep the timing belt is inside the engine. So many parts, and so many bolts. Finally, the bolts on the large gears are fully tightened, the upper engine cover is installed, and everything is secured with an electronic wrench. So now tell me, does paying over $1,000 to replace a timing belt still seem unreasonable?